With Mac OS 8, you can perform any tasks at the same time while continuing to use your computer. With the Multitasking Finder in Mac OS 8, you can copy files locally or across the network, duplicate folders and empty the trash while you continue to launch applications, open files, and organize your information. The performance improvements of the new PowerPC Optimized Finder are focused on ensuring the system is always completely responsive to your activities. Throughout Mac OS 8, Progressive Disclosure lets you know the status of any operation, letting you select the level of information shown, whether an unobtrusive summary or a detailed status. When the contents of an open window take more than a few seconds to display or refresh, background window updating now returns control to you. While the display is being updated, the spinning arrows in the window header show that the operation is in process. Mac OS 8 makes it easier to quickly scan through the contents of a folder. Live window scrolling continuously updates the display of window contents during all scrolling operations. Mac OS 8 provides new features for managing and organizing your information more effectively. Now when you drag any icon in the finder onto any container, the container springs open showing its contents. This allows you to navigate quickly and easily through the entire hierarchy of your system. Continue to drag and hold until you reach the location where you want to file the information. If you change your mind about where you want to file the item, you can just drag outside the window and it will close again, allowing you to continue to another destination. Once the icon is dropped into its destination, all of the folders that were open during the drag automatically close, leaving only the destination folder open. Spring-loaded folders also work even when you are just opening folders without dragging an icon. By starting with a click and a half on the first folder, you can activate the spring-loaded feature to quickly navigate to your destination. With Mac OS 8, any window in the finder can be dragged to the bottom of the screen where it becomes a small title bar. When you click on this title bar, the window pops up to display its contents while remaining anchored to the bottom of the screen. If you drag an item out of the window, the window pops back down, getting out of your way. If you drag an item onto the title bar, the window pops up to allow you to drag the item into the window. You can make any finder window into a pop-up window. Just drag it to the bottom of the screen or use the view menu. To return a pop-up window to normal window behavior, just drag it so that the bottom no longer touches the edge of the screen. Even when all other finder windows have been closed, pop-up windows remain accessible as titles at the bottom of the screen. As part of the new platinum appearance of the Mac OS, it is much easier to quickly see how the items in a window are sorted and to change that sorting by clicking on the buttons at the tops of the columns. In response to customer requests, Mac OS 8 adds a date created field, which displays and retains the date and time when an item was first created. This is in addition to the existing date modified, which is updated each time the file is changed and saved. With Mac OS 8, not only can view options be different for each folder, but their arrangement can also be made persistent. Arrangements replace and significantly enhance the previous cleanup command in the special menu. They give you more options for arranging the icons and provide the option to make their arrangement persistent. That means that whenever items are added or removed, or the window is resized, the items in the window always reorder to maintain the specified icon or button arrangement. Since the desktop can now have its own view settings, even desktop items now can be buttons. The new platinum appearance clearly indicates inactive windows. This makes it easy to see that the desktop is selected because no windows are currently active. Mac OS 8 again sets the industry standard for aesthetics. And of course you have complete control over the visual personality of your computer. You can choose from a variety of accent colors, which are coordinated with a new series of desktop patterns. You also have more flexibility in personalizing your desktop, not only with customizable tiled patterns, but now with the ability to display any picture across the entire desktop background. Window Shade is one of the most popular features of the Mac OS. However, it's also one of the best hidden. In Mac OS 8, you can collapse windows by clicking an easy-to-find control in the title bar window. The window collapse control also supports option clicking, which collapses all the open windows in the finder. The power of drag and drop has now been extended with new drag indicators. Drag indicators make it much easier to use the common file manipulation commands, such as moving, copying, and making aliases. 
When you drag an item in the finder to a destination, the arrow cursor changes to reflect the operation to be performed. For example, if you move an item to a different folder on the same disk, the cursor doesn't change to indicate that the item will be moved. If you press the Option key, a plus sign appears to show that the item will be duplicated. This is also the case if you drag the item to a different volume, where it will be copied. Finally, if you press the Command and Option keys together, a curved arrow appears on the cursor to indicate that an alias to the item will be created at the destination. To address the broadest set of needs possible, Mac OS 8 provides a scalable interface. This doesn't just mean the Mac OS has been simplified for novice users. Apple has added rich new features for power users too. For novice users, the short menus in the simplified finder provide just the basic commands they need to get their work done without overwhelming them with commands such as making aliases, setting permissions for file sharing, or erasing their hard disk. Browsing and selecting menus is easier for all users now that menus are sticky, that is, they remain open after a single click. This works even for complicated submenus. With the new View as Button feature, capabilities that were previously available only in the popular launcher and at eSoftware software are now available throughout the Finder. You can set any window in the Finder to be viewed as buttons, so you can open documents and launch applications with just one click. With this feature, young or novice users don't have to master the complexities of double-clicking. Even picking colors is much easier with Mac OS 8. You no longer need to be a graphics professional or optical physicist who understands complex color models just to select a background color for your web page. While Apple continues to support picking colors through standard color models such as RGB and CMYK, you now have a considerably simpler interface for choosing colors. With a crayon color picker, you can choose the color you want and see a sample of that color with its name displayed for you. To make image editing even easier, all of the color pickers allow you to use the option key to turn the cursor arrow into an eyedropper. Then you can click on any color on the screen to set the color picker to that color. This makes it very easy to grab that specific shade of orange you like from your favorite sunset picture. Experienced macOS users will notice that many of the menus have been reorganized into a more logical grouping of commands. Also, new keyboard shortcuts have been added. In addition, Apple has provided new commands that customers have asked for, such as move to the trash and show original, so you can find the file that an alias points to without opening the get info panel. To give advanced users the exact command they need when they need it, direct access to finder menu items is now available through contextual menus. Contextual menus contain only those menu items that are appropriate for the item currently selected in the finder, making them the quickest and fastest way to manage your information. For example, you can find an original file by simply control clicking on its alias and choosing the show original command. And when you are done with an alias or any file, the move to trash menu item gives you an alternative to dragging it to the trash. With Mac OS 8, your Mac OS computer can work easily with DOS and Windows files. For example, if you insert a PC diskette into your computer running Mac OS 8, the diskette appears on the desktop just like a Mac OS diskette. You can use the PC diskette just like you use a Mac OS diskette. All of your DOS and Windows 95 files show up as icons, just as you would expect them to. When you double-click on a DOS or Windows file to open it, Mac OS 8 works with the built-in database translators to automatically present you with a list of applications on your computer that can open the file. Once you select the application you want to use, the built-in database translators convert the file to a format the application can use. The database translators maintain the formatting of your Windows and DOS files. For example, in this file that was created in WordPerfect on Windows 95, you can see that graphics, color, font, paragraph, and other formatting information was preserved. The database translators also let you save your documents back to PC format. So you can edit this document, select Save As, and you can choose from a number of file formats for Mac OS, DOS, and Windows. In this example, we'll save it as a WordPerfect for Windows file. PC file support with Mac OS 8 is not limited only to floppy diskettes. You can also use DOS and Windows SCSI drives, SciQuest drives, and other media drives. With Mac OS 8, it's easy for you to share files and media in a multi-platform world.